Hello, my name is Tom with DNH Water Systems, and I'm here to show you how to properly calibrate your new blue white M3 or M4 metering pump. As you can see here, I have my new installed pump, and I am here to do a drawdown and a calibration for the pump's flow rate. So, to do so, I'm going to fill up my calibration column, have everything plumbed correctly to do a 30 second drawdown, as you can see it says here on my calibration column. So I'm gonna get the pump started, and as soon as I get to zero, I'm going to start my calibration. Zero. So I have a timer going for 30 seconds right here. I'm gonna take note of the feed rate that my pump is going at, which is 5.72 gallons an hour. Your pump can be running at any speed for this drawdown, it is not important. So as soon as our timer gets to 30 seconds, I'm going to stop the pump. Show me exactly where I'm at, 30. So as you can see there, I see 5.2 gallons an hour for our 30 second drawdown. So over here, I'm gonna go to my formula, which as you can see here, is my drawdown number over my displayed number. So, as you can see here, my drawdown was 5.2 gallons an hour divided by my displayed, which was 5.72 gallons an hour. I divide them and I get 0.91. So then I'm gonna take this number and multiply it by what the factory set max flow rate on the pump is. So let's go to the pump here going to go into the menu, input setup, max flow rate. Okay, so the pump came out of the factory with the max flow rate set at 1,200 milliliters per minute. So I'm going to take my number here that I got 0.91 multiplied by 1,200 milliliters per minute. My output is 1,092 milliliters per minute. So just like that, I'm going to go over here, back to this, 1,092 milliliters per minute, and I'm going to press enter, and now my pump is calibrated. To double check that, so you can notice nothing has changed since we did the drawdown. If I put the pump back into action, boom. It's telling me that I'm pumping exactly 5.2 gallons per hour, which was perfectly measured in our previous drawdown. So thank you very much, and good luck with your brand new pump.